Hello and welcome to another Battletech tips and tricks video. Uh, this is part two of an ongoing series that I, I'll be posting. If you haven't seen part one, LRMs and stability damage, I recommend you watch that before this one as it directly coincides with this video. I'll put the link below. Now what you're looking at right here is my sniper mech. Uh, I'm currently using a Centurion CN9AL medium mech that's 50 tons. And the reason why I wanted to showcase this mech is because you can find these fairly early. They're very common. And uh, there aren't too many builds that I could get to work on this mech. Uh, but this is a fairly good uh, use of it. So if you're wondering what to do with your Centurion CN9AL, this is uh, something that you might want to consider. Now, for my sniper mechs, I personally prefer two PPCs. Now there are other choices that a lot of people like to use like um, AC-10, AC-5s, Gauss rifle, uh, but I, I personally I, I prefer the PPC because uh, you know they're they're actually very light so you can put uh, these weapons on lighter mechs that you find. Um, now there's a lot of people who personally dislike the PPC uh, and they, whenever they see energy hard points, they'd rather put medium lasers because medium lasers tend to do a lot more damage. But you know, medium lasers aren't very good for a sniper mech because they have uh, a lot lower range. Now, uh, before I talk about PPC, let me talk about medium lasers. Uh, medium lasers do 25 damage per one ton, and it only takes up one slot, and they only generate 10 heat. That's a very, very efficient weapon. Uh, it can do a lot of damage for relatively low heat. Now if you look at the PPC, it deals 50 damage for 40 heat, but it does take up 7 tons. What that means is you can put 7 medium lasers for the same amount of tonnage that one PPC can yield. Uh, you know, that's 25 damage times 7 versus 50. Right, so yeah, medium lasers can definitely do a lot more damage than PPCs, but uh, PPCs do have the benefit that they have a very long range. Uh, so they also deal all their damage in a very specific location. So if I was to fire a PPC at an enemy, that 50 damage, if it hits, will hit just one location. So let's say I, I shoot the left leg or the right leg, uh, it'll be 50 damage straight to that one part. Whereas if I was to fire a bunch of medium lasers, it, it could be like 25 to the leg, 25 to the right torso, 25 to the left arm, and a lot of it might go to the center torso, and that's not exactly what I want. Now, the biggest reason though that I like the PPC is it also has stability 20. Uh, what that means is you can use these PPCs to push mechs over uh, if they already have a lot of stability put on them. And that's why uh, sniper mechs and LRM mechs go together very well. So what I'll do uh, is I'll use the LRM mech uh, to increase the enemy stability rating really high and then I'll use the PPCs to knock them over. Whereas if I was to use medium lasers, they have a stability of zero. So they're not very good at knocking enemy mechs over. Now there are other weapons that you could use. Things like uh, SRMs are also really good at uh, knocking mechs over, but once again their range is standard, whereas the PPC can fire from very far away. Uh, the other problem with SRMs is they spread out their damage, and I really try to concentrate my damage that I'm dealing to the opponent to one or two locations. Very specifically, I like to concentrate the damage on the legs. So uh, I prefer the PPCs for that final nudge when it comes to knocking over an enemy mech. But that's not to say that I don't like SRMs. I do actually like them. And I'll have a brawler video posted later on that you can uh, watch. And uh, I'll basically explain more about SRMs and medium lasers in that video. But anyway, so uh, I'm going to go and show you this mech. Now I have two PPCs here. 
and uh, as you can see I have max armor on my right arm and that's because I don't want to lose my PPC uh, so if possible if you find a mech later on in the future that has energy hard points in the torsos those are much better options than having them in the arm but for the centurion as you can see uh, my only energy points are in the center torso and the right arm and I can only put one PPC in the center torso as you can see so here we go we have it in the arm uh, in my left side I, I, I cut armor in my left arm because I don't really care about my my left side if it gets blown off it doesn't really matter all that matters is as long as I keep my weapon which is in my center torso on my right arm now I have a lot of heat sinks over here because these PPCs do run very hot they have a heat of 40 now if you have two of them that's 80 heat uh, it's very hard to fire these uh, continuously unlike medium lasers you can fire those all the time PPCs they'll run you very hot very quickly so uh, that's my cyber video uh, stay tuned uh, for more videos in the future if you liked what you saw hit a thumbs up if you really liked what you saw and you want to see more I recommend hitting that subscribe button it would really help me out and uh, if you really 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 like this video uh, please consider following me on patreon uh, with only uh, you know a dollar a month it could really help me out uh, and help this channel grow uh, but anyways thank you for watching and uh, I'll see you next time take care